thing to do. Homework. And who told you that a game party was all at the same place? Homework. Why you lying, girl? You don't have no homework. You're graduating from high school in one month. And who's gonna be asking you to the game parties without us? Why be natural, you know, especially to your friends. Others that can't help themselves. This is very commendable. Um, 
No, Mom. I'm sorry. It's called a Monday. Well, as long as for a good reason, right? Right. Whatever makes you happy, that's what's right for you. And when you find that thing, you know, nothing can bring you down.
be an army of one proud to be a Marine. Good bloody guts. What do you say, Robert Bob? I just can never do that. It's not me, okay? I don't want to do that anymore. Well, with that kind of attitude, we don't want you in the Marine Corps. Effective immediately, you are hereby dismissed dishonorably.
do I do? <laughs> and how is Hubba doing in his life, her life in the military? Hubba hates the military life. Mm. She wrote her and, and and told that they're gonna discharge her early. Mm. Um, she she can wait to leave that place with all that marching and drag collars. Oh, my 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 my, yeah, my goodness! goodness. She's so independent. Oh. She feel like as long as she's there mm. and, and that's what she's supposed to do. Why should she march and step? Why right? should she? A cheers to the to the bub to the hubbers to the bubbers. Yes. Whatever their name is. Uh, to their daughter yeah. and to the many grandchildren to come. Okay. Cheers to the bubbles. Cheers, Cheers to the bubbles.
she needs rest. Yeah. She is going to have to shoulder some responsibility one day. You are going to have clones to feed and clothe. Don't you understand, how? <laughs> Milton, don't put any other pressure on her. Just because all of her friends at the cheerleading squad got married? Oh, by the way, how about did I tell you that they Mark mar married Joy and Lemuel? Remember Lemuel? Yeah, and William, they got married, and guess what? You never guessed. He comes already. Well. <laughs> Will you stop him, Mother Father? When it's time for me to get married and come, I will. And not a moment before. If you don't mind, I'm going to my room. And I did find a job. So there. What job? I am a paper stacker. Paper stacker. Minimum fucking wage. Minimum wage. She would be too pushy on her. After all, it's her life. I suppose you're right. <laughs> Get that position. Was it vertical or horizontal? Roughly. It was 
frequent. Just keep working. All right, break time. <laughs>
closet as far as my parents and me go. You know how serious that can be. Been there, done that too. I'll bet I'm just gonna do it. We were going to elope, but I figure, why can't I have a wedding and wear a white skirt? I want to have clothes, a home. I just have to go to nursing school at night. A lot of girls have done that. Yeah. Have you not told your parents about your plans? No, they're so old school. They will find out what everybody else does. Oh. I, I put the announcement in the weekend newspaper. Ooh, I'm smart. Girl, I'm so proud of you. The truth is out there. You have to be happy. Is that too much to ask? Do I have to put my love and happiness in jeopardy?
mean, come on! I thought that we were friends. I just couldn't tell you. I just couldn't. Gay Uranus. 
established law is established law and science is federal law. If science can make it so, then it is the natural law and it has been established for over a hundred years. Science is the basis of prosecution's argument. This is what makes this so difficult and very hard to defend. We have to prove that science is wrong. I don't care about the science. I don't care about the law. Can nobody tell me that law does not exist? I don't even care if they kept me love for a hundred years. They're trying to. I don't even care if they execute me. They're trying that too. <laughs> well, that's why I'm here. It's going to be a hellish case. We just have to prove to the judge and the jury that you believe in something that science can verify. Love. Established law of Science cannot verify love. Only love can make love. Science cannot exist that love does not exist. All right? Because <coughs> love is the greatest law. You said my love is strong. Yes, 
you do. I want to secure medical and dental for my beloved one. I just want to marry my pony. Why can't I marry my pony? Why my love is wrong? Oh, why don't you think of me? I gave up. That's why your last, your eyes are locked up, boy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Order in the court. Did you say? 
something, but I am so desperate. Listen, Pony. We are animals that graze and eat. We are prim and proper and always neat.
Marvin. One more outburst from you, and I'm going to deactivate your ass out of here. You may continue, Dr. Elwood. Thank you. It's awfully hot. Um, you see, <coughs> the building blocks of life. You see these little ladder things, they connect everything that is, that creates the life. If you do connect these little ladder things and you don't have anything, you have a lot of shit. <laughs> That's S for Mitch, your honor. Okay, let's see. Science, therefore, with thou, since precedent set here on the planet of gay Uranus, has explained in the most explicit and specific kind of way that as long chemically and thusly that is natural, that a man and a man can clone a baby, and a woman and a woman can clone a baby, but, hmm, a woman and a horn and call it? That's illegal. That's Objection, Your Honor. Here's it. Against the law, I ain't hear it. Objection overruled. That's what my research says, and that's what science has proven. You may Where step down, Dr. Elmwood. I'm sure you say that way. Thank you very much. <laughs>
What about the freedom to be secure in health and home and happiness? Look at you. Who is the animal now? So many questions. So many questions without answers. I demand answers. An answer. What is it I feel? Question. 
but the answer is death before dishonor. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury and your honor, I therefore demand the severest penalty of the law, life in prison or death, without the possibility of parole and no burial. I agree he's guilty.
romantic. Oh, oh, oh. is a stir and I can feel it now, Gladys. Oh. Doctor Lee, is it true that throughout 
Gatorading history that it is impossible for a man and a woman to clone with an animal. Yes, that is why Supreme Corporate Law clearly states, if science can make it so, so it is the natural law. Dr. Lee, my client is facing death penalty. No shit. <clears throat> Dr. Lee, my client, Ms. Hubba has been guilty of the heinous crime of wanting to marry her pony without the possibility of clonation. Dr. Lee, her sentence is up to the jury. Take time to load and find plans better down. Are you done yet? I'm in the court. Dr. Lee, <clears throat> my client, Miss Hubba Bubba, has been charged guilty and is facing life in prison or death without the possibility of parole. Dr. Lee, what is your scientific theory about that? Easy. The law is wrong. <laughs>
Thank <laughs> you.